My name is Isil Khan. Hey, let me ask you a question. Can you just find the weight of an iron pipe? If you can't find, just keep watching the video for the solution. Suppose if we are given a pipe having internal diameter as 10 cm and external diameter as 14 cm. And let's say the length of the pipe is just 5 meters, right? Now, we are just asked to determine the weight of this cast iron pipe, right? This is just an iron pipe, but that's just a cast iron pipe, right? And in the solution, remember some things are given like the length, the internal and external diameters. So in the solution, the weight of this cast iron pipe must be its volume times unit weight of the material, where the volume may be the cross-sectional area of the pipe times its length. Like you can say the pipe is just a hollow thing, right? So its cross-sectional area must be pi times the external dia square minus the internal dia square divided by 4. So this is the cross-sectional area and times the length, right? Let's do some plug-in check-in. Like the volume equals the pi is a known value, right? So pi times the external diameter, that's just 14 centimeters, right? Or you can say 0.14 meters. So 0.14 square minus the internal diameter, that's just 10 centimeters or 0.10 meters, right? So 0.10 square divided by 4 and times the length, this will make this guy as the volume, right? So the length is just 5 meters. By doing some maths, we can get of course the volume of the pipe is 0.0376991 cubic meters, right? Now we have of course the volume. So we can do some plug and check in in the bow formula. Like the weight equals the volume is known. We did this guy a few seconds ago, right? Times the unit weight of the material. This means the unit weight of those material which the pipe is made of, right? So the unit weight of cast iron must be used. And that's of course just 7200 kg per cubic meters, right? You can see in this table. If the pipe is made up of steel, you can use of course 7850 kg per cubic meters. This time the pipe is made up cast iron, so you can use 7200 kg per cubic meters, right? In the same formula. So the weight equals 271.433 kg. And that's it. So this is how we determine the weight of a pipe. No problem if it's made up any material, right? That's the same process. The only thing that will be changed in the process is just the unit weight, right? So that's it. Hey, at the end, if you like the video, make sure to thumbs up and subscribe to support me or motivate me by making more videos, right? Thank you dears for watching. See you next time.